would describe Damien as a massive geek, but not in a bad way. Um, he always wants to be better than you, and if you beat him at something, I guess he'll get angry and just learn from the mistake and really quickly adapt. He has always been a very competitive person, playing online games. He would always have to have the best items, the best weapons, and he just has to be winning all the time. It was my dad who introduced us to video games, so on the weekends we would come here and from morning till night we would be playing games. I played Counter-Strike about 20 years ago. And then every time when he came home, I played with them. And uh, he got a quite good talent for that. All my children, just like my friends, like my brother and sister. I, I never feel like I'm his father. <laughs> well, my dad is, feels like a friend to me, like a really good friend. He's never really strict. He, he's a really funny character. I always said, when you study, please focus your school. And secondly, your hobbies, wherever you like. Since I was little, they always wanted me to be something more. They had really high expectations of me. And that's why I chose to finish my studies first in uni before moving on to Pro Dota. Just came back from university, his last exam, and was like, oh, mum, dad, uh, I'm going to Korea to play video games for a living. I said, and you really want to go there? How long? He said, maybe one year, two years. Huh? That long? <laughs> You know, everyone was shocked and amazed, but also just like, yeah, he needed to be there. He just needed to go somewhere else, and it was a matter of time, yeah. My dad, like, pretty much watches all my games, even though he doesn't play the game at all. I keep watching them. I go to buy an iPad 24 hours next to me. <laughs> I said, Damien, go, 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 Newbie, go, go, go. <laughs> right now, my whole focus is just Dota. I mean, it's not realistic to play Dota until like maybe like 40. I just, I just really, really want to make the most out of what I have right now. Having someone who I can look up to that's not afraid of what other people say is something that's very inspiring to me. I think he's been a very good example for us. If there's anything you want to do, you just have to put your heart out and go for it and don't be afraid. Yeah.